Time for what are the odds as we check out odds to win NFL Offensive Rookie of the Year. Joe Burrow, the favorite at plus 200. You have Tua Tagovailoa at plus 700. Jerry Judy plus 1200. And further down the list is Denzel Mims at plus 6600. So if you bet 100 bucks, you'd win a cool 6600. Mark Malusas and Sal Licata with me and Moose. It's early, but this year is tougher than usual, especially for rookies to prepare. So do you think it's a big deal or a little deal that Denzel Mims had to miss practice Friday? Yeah, I mean, I think it's a big deal dealing with that hamstring injury. I don't, I don't think there's any doubt about it. Number one, for him transitioning from Baylor, being the guy that was uh, defined by his speed as a wide receiver collegially, Sal, and then all of a sudden dealing with this kind of injury, taking a strange step. And then you look at the scenario dealing with that and going to the NFL, the limitations now as we're all dealing with the global pandemic, uh, the work that you can get through and trying to transition to the National Football League. Yeah, it's a big deal. I mean, if you were expecting big things from him at the wide receiver position for a, a skill set and for a position where there is not a lot of quality depth on this team where they saw the best guy leave for the Carolina Panthers and Robbie Anderson in the offseason it's a big deal I'm with you it's a big deal you're already to all your points Moose he's already behind as it is because of the pandemic and because of all the new rules and regulations he can't now start because of a, what, what seems to be now a significant hamstring injury he's saying you know gorgeous precautionary but Mims it seems to be a little bit of an issue here that's a problem that's a big deal Jets have high expectations for him they need him now look they need Sam Darnold to play well they need everybody on that offense to play well Jets are in need they've been starved Moose for big time offensive players here so they need Denzel Mims in a year with a, a lot of wide receivers being drafted and a lot of skill position players that you know maybe jump off the screen at you in their rookie year can Mims be that for the Jets this is not the start that you want so I'm with you that that's a big deal even though it's early it's still a big deal I agree with all of your points, but I'm going to go ahead and call this a medium deal just because we don't know exactly how much time he's going to miss. But getting those physical reps obviously is what makes for chemistry with the quarterback. So you hope he doesn't miss a whole lot. Moose, Sal, thank you.